The Rijksmuseum in Amsterdam has four floors including the ground floor. Ground floor is the place with special collections from 1100 to 1600. First floor is called the Enlightenment with paintings on display from 1700 to 1800. There is one self-portrait of Van Gogh on this floor. Second floor is called the Gallery of Honor showing work from 1600 to 1700. Rembrandt's famous The Night Watch is on the second floor. Third floor is dedicated to modern art from 1950 to 2000. There is an aircraft on display on this floor. The floors are not arranged in chronological order. I am going to take you through all the floors so stay tuned. The Rijksmuseum in Amsterdam is dedicated to Dutch arts and history. It is the largest art museum in the Netherlands with over 2 million visitors visiting every year with the exception of 2020 and 21 when the museum only received 650,000 visitors. The museum building has two entrances. It doesn't matter which entrance you take as it's all connected inside. I'm getting in my favorite entrance where the cafe and the museum shop is. We are starting a tour from the ground floor. Remember, toilets and lockers are on this floor and lockers are free. The Rijksmuseum is home to more than 1 million objects dedicated to arts, crafts and history from 1200 to 2000. Around 8000 objects are on display. The objects on display range from ship models to silver, glass, porcelain, jewellery, musical instruments, arms and armour. It is definitely a delight to visit the ground floor if you are fond of ships, porcelain and musical instruments. Let's go to the first floor. You can either take the stairs or the lift. More than 2000 paintings from the Dutch Golden Age are on the first and the second floor. This is the first floor and I'll take you to my favourite part of the museum which is this section showing works of Dutch painters who were associated with the Amsterdam Impressionism movement. This section has works of Isaac Israels, Anton Mauve, Willem, George Hendrik and many more. There is also a large painting of the Battle of Waterloo and a huge painting of Napoleon on this floor. After admiring the paintings displayed on the first floor, it's time to move to the second floor. And as I mentioned before, you can either take the stairs or the elevator. In my past few visits, I have observed that this floor is the most crowded floor because of many reasons which we will discuss soon. I advise you to visit the Rijksmuseum as early in the day as possible and start your tour from the second floor. Also bear in mind that school trips to the museums are very much encouraged here in the Netherlands. There are days when the museum is crowded with school kids sitting on the floor sketching the famous Night Watch. The Night Watch is Rembrandt's largest and most famous painting. It is displayed on the second floor. The Night Watch represents groups of civilian soldiers who defended the city from attack. Operation Night Watch was launched as the painting is almost 400 years old and showed signs of aging such as discoloration and cracks in the paint layers. After two and a half years of rigorous research, treatment began in January 2022. The painting has been mounted to a new strainer and sits behind this glass compartment. You can admire the painting only from a distance. However, there's a copy of the Night Watch on display and that's how I was able to take these close-up shots. Apart from the famous Night Watch, there are many other paintings of Rembrandt on display. His self-portrait, portrait of his son and many more. The second floor also has Vermeer's work. No wonder why this is the most crowded floor. In fact, 
The largest ever Vermeer show is taking place in the Rijksmuseum in 2023 and that will include the girl with the pearl earring. The museum is bringing Vermeer's paintings from all over the world. The exhibition starts on February 10th through June 4th of 2023. You can book your tickets now on the website. I leave the link below. You will also find amazing ink on canvas work by Willem Van on this floor. In fact, the Rijksmuseum Research Library, which is the largest public art history research library in the Netherlands, is also on the second floor. Remember, there's also a third floor in the museum, and let's explore that now. Third floor is dedicated to modern art. There is an aircraft on display and works of Moritz, who was a 20th century graphic artist. I'm hungry and tired now. It's time to have lunch at the museum cafe, which is located on the ground floor. That's a quick look at the menu, and this is what I ended up ordering. Ice skating in front of the Rijksmuseum is one of the winter activities here in Amsterdam. I'm making this video in December 2022 and that's how I was able to capture these shots. I'll take you to the Van Gogh Museum next week which is only a 3 minutes walk from the Rijksmuseum. If you found this video helpful, please do give a like and hit that subscribe button. See you soon.